Hello everyone, this is Aida Golami from Agreements of Research Lab and in today's video I'm going to teach you how to add the total row in Excel. So you can see I have a table in here. I have some data in here which is not in the format of the table which Excel knows as a table, okay? So first of all, you should have a table. So select your data, go for insert tab and then click on table click ok and then you can see this table is created then in table style options in design tab check the total row you can see the total row is created in here all you have to do is to click on the cell on the cell containing the number in the total row and then in the drop down list you can see the type of uh, these calculations so you can have average count count numbers maximum standard deviation etc okay so let's say in here i want the standard deviation let's say then you can copy the same calculations for all your columns so i select and copy that to all my cells so that's it i can have let's say sum of the numbers and i again copy that to all my columns so that's how you can add the total row in excel the other thing the other tip that i wanted to mention in here is that you you essentially do not need to have the table view okay so you can have your data in this regular format and all you have to do is to select the cell down one of your columns go for home tab in editing segment in this sum sign click on the drop down list and you can see all those functions so i want to have the average click enter and then you have the average okay so you can again you can Mm, copy that cell to the other columns also that's the total row you know so that's it for today's video i hope you learned something new please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel i will see you in the next videos and bye